Guys, Pick Up Brick Productions here, and today we're going to be doing another uh, review, actually, of a cool set. Uh, set number 40410. Yeah, this is a Christmas Carol by Charles Dickens. So here it is, looking really awesome, but yeah, so there is the box itself. Looking super cool. Uh, yeah, so I guess... Let's just get started. Uh, I'll see you guys when this is all built up. We can take a look at these characters and stuff. Wow. Uh, this looks really cool. I'm really excited to build this. Four bags. One sticker sheet. Which, wow, that's a lot of stickers. Uh, I guess I'll see you guys when it's all built up and we can review it and do all the things. So first, starting with the figures, we have Tiny Tim. Um, now, basically, this figure looks really awesome. I uh, I really like the red scarf and the little stick that he has, but uh, other than that, he is just using the kind of generic Lego uh, guy hair. So yeah, just in a lighter brown. But uh, yeah, so other than that, he does have the um, cool little face for Tiny Tim. I don't know if that is a new face, um, it does have some face printing on the back, which is kind of like a more dirtied up look, but yeah, so, turning him around again, you can see that awesome red scarf again, and taking the red scarf off, you can get a better look at his torso print. Which, if I'm not mistaken, is Ron Weasley's from, I don't know which set, but yeah, so. There it is, looking really awesome, and the back shirt, um, torso printing. And just using some normal dark brown legs, the figure is complete. Uh, I guess I'll just show you, well, the complete figure again. Sorry, this is taking me a long time, but yeah. So there is Tiny Tim, looking very awesome. Uh, yeah, now I guess let's get into the next figure. Here is Bob Cratchit, or Crotchet. I don't exactly know how to pronounce it, but yeah. So there he is, looking very awesome. Now, I don't think this figure is using any um, new uh, prints, um, except for the torso. I'm pretty sure that is a new print, but other than that... I'm pretty sure all the other stuff is from different figures, but that's completely okay, and I really like this figure, so it's pretty much okay, but, um, uh, also in the comments, <laughs> you let me know, like, how the name is pronounced, I guess, so, yeah, but, whatever, so there's the figure looking really awesome, um, I don't think he has any, um, back head printing on there, but, yeah, other than that, this figure is a really awesome figure, and uh, the torso printing on the back also looks really great. Um, don't exactly know, um, I'm pretty sure that torso is new once again, but yeah. If it isn't new, then I have no idea where it's from. But, uh, yeah, I guess let's just take a look at a another figure, or the last figure, uh, which is Ebenezer Scrooge. So there is Ebenezer Scrooge looking very awesome. I uh, love the <laughs> massive top hat that he has going on. But uh, yeah, um, I'm pretty sure for this figure, there are new, the no new prints except for the face. So I'm pretty sure that is a new print. Let me know in the comments if it is not. But yeah, if it is, then this figure is awesome because that face, that face print is looking very awesome. But uh, other than the face print, I'm pretty sure... Nothing of this figure is, um, new, um, in any way, but it's completely fine. Uh, I don't really care, but I really like this set, so, uh, I'll show you the set after we have gone over this figure. Now, he does come with a really nice umbrella, so there it is. Kind of like it's already, um, closed up, but yeah, so. <sighs> Sorry. Get that back into his hand, we can show you the full figure. Um, so yeah, he obviously does not have any back face printing because, well, the hat is massive and doesn't ex exactly go over the other side. But yeah, so there's Ebenezer Scrooge and looking really awesome. Uh, so yeah, 
I guess let's just get into the actual build of the set. Here's the build itself, kind of resting on this little book thing, looking super awesome. Uh, it's actually the Charles Dickens book, A Christmas Carol, so that's even cooler that they um, added the name there, so yeah. But uh, this looks awesome. I really like the way that this turned out. Uh, I'm just showing you the outside of it um, right now, but yeah. So this looks so cool. Um, yeah, the lamppost right here looks awesome. I guess I'll just show you. Um, the path leading up to the door looks super cool as well. This door does not open. It's just brick built, but still looking super awesome. Uh, this lantern also looks very cool. And so does this bush right there. And uh, just turning it over, you can see the lamppost and stuff. And the little fence there. And this awesome roof design. Um, just so cool. It looks so awesome with that cheese slope design looking super cool. And the chimney just poking out. You can see it going down there as well, which I think is a really neat detail. But yeah, so this just looks super cool. Now just taking a look at the inside of the house. This has a lot of details. So those two wreaths, or the wreath right there, is super awesome with the candles beside it and that picture also super awesome uh, of the house itself and then these stickers I really I really like these stickers actually I don't usually like stickers but these ones are super cool and they kinda just make the house look um, a little bit better so yeah or the inside of the house at least because the back of or the outside of the house just looks so amazing I already showed that off let's just take a look at the inside so the inside of the door once again it does not open up they have a little Christmas tree here in their house and then the fireplace looking really cute as well and then the book with amazing detail is super awesome this also opens up don't know it's supposed to go in there but uh, if we take that out you can see the inside of the book uh, Looking very interesting, but yeah, so There is the stickers for the title which also look awesome um, Once again, I do not really care for stickers, but these ones look really cool So yeah, I really like these stickers But uh, also for the little stripes on the sides the stickers look pretty cool put that one on a little wrong But whatever it's still pretty cool. So yeah, the book looks super awesome. Don't know what's supposed to go in there once again, but yeah, so this set looks really awesome. Now, let's take a look at the other components such as the instructions and the box. Yeah, let's just take a look at those. Here is the box, and I really love the design for this box. It's so awesome. I just really love it. It's like, it's so cool. Just the design, everything about it, um, the little ribbon going down there just looks so sick. And I really love, I, I put this up as a, as a display piece because look at the box, just looking so cool. You can see Ebene, uh, Ebenezer Scrooge just going, like walking away from the house in the background. You can see them peeking around the corner. It just looks so awesome. You can see some different shots of the house looking very fancy and awesome. So yeah, um... Yeah, very fancy for something that you get free as a promo, but yeah, it's really awesome though. I really like it, and um, it's just super cool. Um, I really like the whole design at the top, the way that all the letters and the ink pen and all that stuff is just going away, which is super cool. It's like all swooping and all that stuff just looking really awesome. I really like the way that this turned out and the way that they made the box. There's one more shot down there of it sliding open, which do not know what's supposed to go in there. And it doesn't really tell you, but yeah, so this is set number 40410 is 8 plus with 333 pieces. This set is awesome. Now let's just take a look at the instructions, which I should actually be able to put up the tripod using this so that it isn't at least a little too high. Um, yeah, here is the instructions. Now, um, basically, this is just normal instruction stuff until you get to the back. It does have, um, oh wait, no, it doesn't have any advertising. Huh, interesting. So yeah, there's the three figures, all the instructions looking very cool. Just has the same print as um, the box does. On the back you can see pretty much a lot of the pieces on here. Uh, I'm pretty sure that is all the pieces, but uh, you know, all scrambled out. So yeah, this set looks really awesome. Now let's take a look at the whole set, all the components, all together in one shot.
So here's everything together just from the set going up with all the figures in it and everything going up. We can see the instructions and the box looking really awesome once again. Uh, the instructions also having that cool little print or front page. Here's the set all built up all together. Here it is. Yeah, it just looks super awesome. I love how it's resting on the book. This is an amazing set and I do advise you do, um, <laughs> I guess buy something over or at $150 to get this because it is a pretty awesome set and it's really cool but um yeah if you can find it on eBay or something then that's probably better than trying to get it but um yeah so yeah this is super awesome I really love this set and um I advise you get it too because this is so cool um yeah so that's pretty much it for this video guys, hope you guys liked it, if you did, make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.